Sure speed's still 950, but ISO's 320. Okay, sure it'd be 160. Because I've told it to use the lowest ISO in my auto ISO setting. And the reason will be, in the menus, so if I look in the Q menu, there's my auto ISO, where I've got dynamic range on auto. And if you've got dynamic range on auto, or 200 or 400, that'll override your auto ISO. Because if the camera detects a high dynamic range shot that you're about to take, and it picks dynamic range 200 for say, 200 it can only use with an ISO of 320 or greater. If it picks 400, it'll be 640 or greater. So if you want to use the full ISO range you've selected in auto ISO, you need to have dynamic range set to 100. And also, your dynamic range priority needs to be off. 